Hi traders, uh, welcome to this video. Today we are going to show another interesting uh, trading strategy which can be used uh, on any currency pair, although as stated here, high, higher time frames tend to work better uh, with this strategy. Uh, it is uh, based uh, on only two indicators, um, namely the ADX with the settings of 14 and the stochastic with the settings of 533 as shown here. Uh, now, the strategy is based on the idea that the oscillate that oscillators like the stochastic tend to generate better signals in a ranging market or when the trend is sideways and uh, to determine whether the trend is sideways or trending we are using the ADX indicator uh, which is this uh, thick uh, blue line uh, here uh, shown on our chart. Now the uh, conditions for the ADX are to be below the 25 level on the indicator chart which is shown with this gray line here and uh, the yellow area here indicates all the area on the ADX where the main ADX line is below 25 which indicates the sideways market conditions or uh, when the market is not trending. So once that happens, like uh, we have indicated with the rectangles, uh, when that happens, uh, we are looking for either a bullish or a bearish signal on the stochastic and that is the usual crossover from either the overbought or the oversold area so in case of the in case of the overbought um, conditions on the stochastic the signal is bearish and uh, a bearish crossover outside uh, of the overbought area occurs on the stochastic as here while in case of the bullish signal the stochastic is oversold and a bullish crossover occurs outside of the oversold area so here on this daily chart of euro dollar uh, we have marked uh, all the cases when the strategy generated either a bullish signal with a green rectangle or a bearish signal with a red rectangle like this and we can see all those other cases for example here the bullish signal was generated while the bearish signal came around these candles here in this case uh, we have the bullish signal here and uh, a successful bearish signal at this point uh, another two bullish signals at those two points occurred uh, which were uh, successful and uh, here we have uh, a bearish signal as you can see right along uh, this uh, vertical line which was also successful so thank you for watching uh, guys uh, and uh, i'll see you in our next video